Last year I made some tutorials on GDevelop 5 and the Space Shooter game. I got a little sidetracked from that project, but I wanted to come back to it. And today when I opened up GDevelop 5, it was a lot different after the update or the updates that it underwent over the past almost year. So I need to redo those tutorials. This is the beginning of remaking the Space Shooter tutorials. Go to your favorite search engine and type in G develop five and click on it. So this looks like the desktop app that I used to use and it looks like they put it online, which is pretty cool. Um, I like the desktop app, so I'm going to use it and I want to download it. Click download desktop app. I'm not sure what creating an account does. I assume that it allows you to save your games somehow. Um, and if you want to do that, just click here and sign in. I'm going to download the desktop app. And now I have a Mac, so I'm going to click on Mac to download and I'm going to get started. I'm, um, I'm following the tutorial, but the tutorial is for the old version of GDevelop 5. Um, I'll leave the link below. However, so the first step is to create a new project. Okay, I did that. And then it says create an empty game and create a first scene. I'm not seeing that, so I'll uh, take a look around. So the tutorial says to rename your scene by right clicking and selecting edit. Let me try that. Okay, I'm not getting any, not seeing any sort of rename. Right click's not working. Um, I know that one of the steps is to create a grid, so I'll create a grid. And now I'm going to set up the grid, right click on it, and I'm going to make the cell width 16 by 16. And apply. So, so I'm going to add a new object and I'm going to click on Sprite and add animation and add so within my space shooter game I have my assets and within my assets I'm gonna find something called player and there's my spaceship And I'm going to click Apply. Uh, first, I'm going to name it. I'm going to name it Player. Not sure what this is. I'll delete it. Alright, so in the tutorial it says create the first scene and it shows this. But in the new version, you have to click up here in the project manager. 
And now I'm going to rename this scene. So just background. Click on game settings properties. Okay, now I can edit the game resolution. And I believe it's 900 by 500. And I'm gonna change the name to base scene. Okay, and that's uh, step one of the tutorial. Let's see if I can get this one done faster than the last. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.